What is going on guys, it's Declan here and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to store any vehicle inside of your garage and keep it insured. Now I actually made a little video about this the other day and it was at the very end of a 10 minute video so I wanted to make a new video for you guys today just to explain it into a little bit more detail and show you guys how to do this perfectly. So if you guys do go on to enjoy today's video make sure you hit that like button down below. Once again can we try and shoot for something well over 500 likes that would be amazing. And with that said, let's begin. So, starting this off, the first thing you want to do is get any vehicle that you want to store inside of your garage. This could be any vehicle, you can get the ADA, the Entity, any vehicle that you want and park it just outside of your garage like so. Now what you want to do from there is have your friend watch over the vehicle. Now you can actually do this solo but it is definitely, definitely better to have a friend in the game. It is almost impossible to do without a friend now. And um, yeah, it's a lot harder to do guys than the previous method. It does mess up a lot more. I think it took me around three tries to actually get this to work perfectly. But as you can see, I am doing this with a Z-Type that I just brought in from single player to multiplayer. Now, if you guys want to know how to bring cars in from single player to multiplayer, I will have a link to that in the top right corner of the screen via annotation, as well as in the description below. Nevertheless, once you guys have spawned into your garage, what you then want to do is make sure that you have a job available to you on your job list. And if you don't have any jobs available, what you then need to do is either ring up Martin, Ron, Lester or Simeon and get a job by requesting one from them. Go ahead and request a job from anyone on your contact list, it doesn't really matter as long as you have a job available to you. Anyway, once the mission has arrived, what you then want to do is get into any vehicle that you are willing to sacrifice for the vehicle outside. So as you can see, I'm currently in a rat loader as I don't want this vehicle anymore and I want to replace this with the car outside. So once you get into it, what you then want to do is bring up your phone, then go onto the job list, then press A once on any of the jobs that you have and you will be put onto this screen. Now here is the tricky part guys. You want to press A and RT at the exact same time. Now timing is absolutely essential here. Basically what you are doing is accepting the job and accelerating at the exact same time, which is A and RT on the Xbox and X and R2 on the PlayStation, I believe. Nevertheless, if done correctly, it should spawn you down into a mission lobby like so. And once you eventually do spawn into the lobby, all you want to do is simply quit. Now from there, it should spawn you down into a glitched position inside of your garage like so. And then what you want to do is simply run up to the vehicle that you want to store in your garage and then sit inside the vehicle. Now wait until it glitches you back and it should perfectly glitch you back like so as you're going to see any second now. It will act as like you've just brought the vehicle outside of your garage and what happens now is it has a tracker on it and you have now successfully got the vehicle. You now own this vehicle, it does have insurance on it if the vehicle inside you replaced it with did have insurance on it. And as you can see by the minimap it now has a tracker on it. So that is how you do it guys, you can do this with any vehicle, any supercars and it can be tricky to do, sometimes it may spawn you across the map, it did take me around 2-3 to three tries to actually get this to work perfectly but trust me guys if your friend is watching the vehicle, if you do spawn across the map you can just come back to your garage and keep doing the glitch until it eventually works. And once again guys this does work on any vehicles, things like the Ada, the Entity, even your friend's cars and also cars that you bring in from single player to multiplayer. So I'm going to leave the commentary there, so if you guys did enjoy, be sure to hit that like button down below, it really does help out. Once again, can we try and shoot for something well over 500 likes, that would be awesome. And with that said, I will see you all in the next video.